A 23-year-old man became Oahu's 25th traffic death of the year after crashing his motorcycle this morning on Willakina Drive in Wahiwa. Police say around 5.50 this morning, the motorcyclist broadsided another vehicle that was exiting a residential area. He was taken to the hospital in critical condition where he died. This is the ninth motorcycle traffic fatality this year. HPD held a news conference late this afternoon addressing the recent motorcycle crashes. Bryce Moore reports. Bryce? Good evening, and yes, today's death marks Oahu's 25th traffic fatality in 2023. That's compared to just 18 in the same time last year. And we've actually put together a map to show you all of the fatalities involving two-wheeled vehicles in the past 30 days. We're going to put that up on your screen as I take a look at my notes here. And as you'll see in just a second, just incident after incident of these fatal crashes. Those two fatalities on the west side involved a motorcyclist and a driver who both succumbed to their injuries. And remember, everything you're looking at right now is all within the past month. Police say vehicles with only two wheels are inherently more dangerous than those with four and they add that speed has been a factor in most of these recent deaths. So we're just trying to encourage the public. Um, if you're a motorcycle rider, um, we encourage them to uh, ride like you're invisible, like uh, just assume that vehicles don't see you. Don't weave in and out of traffic. I mean, that's not safe. Um, that just puts you more at a risk. So as a rider, you're already a vulnerable um, vehicle out there so try to limit your your risk taking Honolulu police are also urging motorcycle riders to obey the speed limits and ride within your limits now according to HPD the motorcyclist involved in this morning's Wahiwa crash was wearing a helmet but they also believe that he was speeding at the time and as far as the driver of the vehicle who he broadsided authorities say he only sustained minor injuries and refused transport reporting to you from HPD headquarters I'm Bryce Moore, KH12 News, working for Hawaii. Send it back to you in the studio.